Hollywood, the Red Skelton Show, brought to you by... Ladies and gentlemen, I, uh, tonight our show has to do with uh, Califlar McPug, you know, the prize fighter. <laughs> you know, I used to, I used to be a, a do a little of that myself, you know, prize fighting. When I was a fighter, this was my stance. <laughs> and the reason I stood that way, I had my platex on upside down. <laughs> I was talking to Vincent Price, who's our, our guest star this evening. I said to him, uh, you know, he says, boy, I can never see you as a fighter. I said, what, are you kidding? I said, when it comes to a physique, boy, I got it all over you. And he said, that girdle pops, you're going to have it all over everybody. <laughs> See, uh, I love the, some of these prize fighters, you know, they, they tell stories about them, but they really get, you know, you know, they kind of have uh, been hit around too many times, you know. <laughs> these two fighters, you hit one, but they're going to Las Vegas, see, and they're driving across the desert. Oh, they're going about 90 miles an hour. And this one guy takes a cigarette, opens the door and throws out, slams the door, and the guy driving says, who got in? <laughs> <laughs> well, I was down, down in Florida. There was these two fighters sitting on the, on the bank, and an alligator came up, and this guy said, hey, geez, there's an alligator just bit my leg off. The other guy says, which one? The guy says, I don't know. All alligators look alike to me. <laughs> kick out of uh, the newsreels where they show these athletes, all these guys. I love these guys around down at the, uh, at Muscle Beach, you know. They walk around like this all day. <laughs> <laughs> no girls around yet? Oh, let it go. <laughs> you ever see those guys, you ask them for directions. You say, how do you get to Santa Monica? They say, that way. <laughs> But as I started to say about the slow motion uh, on the uh, newsreels, I like those guys like with the, the shot put, you know, in slow motion, these guys. <laughs> then the javelin. Ha, <laughs> 
And the fellas doing their road work, you know, these guys. <laughs> they see a car park and a girl fixing a tire. <laughs> He tells her to stand back. Now he's going to let it off the jack. And she says, well, let it down easy. My husband's asleep in the back seat. <laughs> So Hercules will be great for your career. J.B., J.B., I don't want to hear another word about it. I refuse to do that picture. Well, it's not that I'm being stubborn. It's just, well, well let's face it. I am a lover, not a fighter. <laughs> Look, the industry's due for another great prize fight. Yarn, have you read the script? Of course I read it, but that prize fight at the scene at the end had me scared to death. Look, Carlisle, you win the fight. I know that, but I didn't find it out to the last page. <laughs> Carlisle, I got a batch of ex-prize fighters out there in the office waiting for interviews. Now, you and I'll pick one out, and he'll show you the ropes. So then I see this bum is getting tired, so yeah. I move in close. Yeah. And I clip him a couple times my left, and I stake with me right, and when he moves in, I kill him. <laughs> Who did I hit? <laughs> Cauliflower McPug. You mean the punch drunk guy that's always hearing boys and bells? Yeah, yeah. Oh, let's lift him up. Oh, I'm sorry, McPug. Oh, it's all right, it's all right. <laughs> Who won that round? <laughs> 
Where are you, fellas? What are you all doing in the ring with me? What are you doing in the ring? We're well, not in the ring, McPug. We're all here for that job. Oh, you're going to become movie star, too, huh? Yeah. Come on, Good. stop, McPug. Yeah, sit down. Make our dogs at home. Yeah, here. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> here we go. Who up? <laughs> These little built chairs may be stylish, but they're not very comfortable. You know? <laughs> I got to get myself a chair. <laughs> I'll smart these monkeys right now. Yes, everybody! I'm going to fly! Oh, oh, <laughs> Boy, I hope I never get as punch drunk as you guys. <laughs> Boy, I'm always hearing bells and boys, get up, get up! <laughs> I put one over on you. There's no boys up there. Are you kidding? There's a whole flock of them. Where, where? Well, oh, they sound like flamingos. <laughs> well, I'm not going to bother with you for a drunk guy. I'm not going to get a job as an actor. Just a minute, but Pat, the line forms to the left. To the left? Which is the left? Which is the left? Yeah. When you fought, what did you always lead with? My chin. <laughs> well, the end of the line is over there, and I'm oh, first. Oh, I do. <laughs> hey, Mom, look, no cavity. <laughs> First. What makes you first? This! <laughs> well, that's what you meant to be first. Oh, I am first. Here, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, uh, 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 wouldn't, uh,
Now, come on, now, let's try that, will you? Yeah, try that right. Let me see, now, now there's you the, uh, the left cross. Left cross, now the right cross. Right. <laughs> now you know why you need the blue cross. <laughs> Are you all right? Yes, I got a glass jaw, you know. Oh. It don't take much to knock me out, you know. <laughs> oh, stay by the bell. <laughs> that's not the bells, too, but that's the door. Oh. <laughs> Valerie Powers is here, sir. Valerie, darling! <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, Valerie, may I present you to my personal trainer, Miss Valerie Powers? This is Mr. Cauliflower McPug. Oh, how do you do? How do you do? Oh, delighted. <laughs> <laughs> Never like to pick up strange germs, you know. <laughs> What's the glass jaw, lady? Oh, oh. Heaven. Oh. <laughs> He's charming, Carlisle. Oh, don't be ridiculous. He's an imbecile. That's a lie. I'm a heavyweight. <laughs> <laughs> what a delightful sense of humor. Really? Oh, and look at that physique. Oh. <laughs> I feel your muscle. I don't feel it. Well, yeah. <laughs> be my dad. <laughs> Watch them all nails, lady. <laughs> Do you mind if I feel your muscles now? Oh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> now they get so much to choose from. You know. <laughs> <laughs> My muscle is right here. Yeah, I'll get to it. I'll get to it. <laughs> you get away from her. We happen to be engaged. What? I am your trainer, and that's as far as it goes. <laughs> Put his arm around me. That's my business. Well, how's business? <laughs> <laughs> well, if that's the way you feel, you and I do not go out together tonight. Well, that's all right with me because I'll go out with Mr. McPug tonight. So there. Yeah, so there. Ooh! Ooh! Oh! My leg! My foot! My foot! You're divorced! My foot! Good heavens! Ooh, my foot! <laughs> Sakes, you poor kid. <laughs> Here, cover up. You must be freezing. <laughs> right this way, sir. Here we are, sir. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> I'm white to you, Buster. I'm white to you. I thought I'd sit down and you pull a chair from under me. Oh, no. I'll pick my own chair if you don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bring you some champagne. Don't forget, don't forget, don't forget the champagne. Yeah. <laughs> well, don't get there. Help me, will you? <laughs> you broke off too much. <laughs> well, if it ain't got it up here, it ain't got it. <laughs> ah, here we are, sir. Oh, thank you for the trophy. I want that. Oh, what is that? It's vintage champagne, the very best. Oh, I do. <laughs> Who's the white guy shooting the boy? Who's the white guy? It's this bottle, sir. Oh, the bottle? Oh, that looks good, yeah. <laughs> I can't remember. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be drinking. I'm in training. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know how. Oh, it's easy. One, but two, one, two, three. But two, one, two, three. You've got one, it. Dance it. One, two, three. Four, one, two, one, two, three. There they are now, over there dancing together. You want me to start a fight with them here, Mr. Wentworth? Yes, I want you to show him up in front of Valerie and all of these people. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
that was really nice. Uh, pardon me, may I cut in? Certainly, sir. Certainly. <laughs> you stupid looking flat nosed goon. Now, wait a minute. That's no way to talk about a lady, boy. <laughs> oh, you want to get tough, eh, stupid? Well, yes and no. What do you mean, yes and no? No, I'm not tough, and yet I am stupid. <laughs> talk to you like that. As long as I get laughed, yeah. Oh, right. I'll put up your tooth. Yeah, put up my tooth. Come on, let's get out. Oh, you want to get up, do you? The pipe must be fixed. I didn't lay a glove on it. Hold it, Mr. McPug. Yes, sir. <laughs> Very well, Mr. McPug, we are ready. Oh, yes. Oh, Well, if it isn't lover boy. Uh, no hard feelings, Mr. Wentworth? Why, certainly not. Here, let me help you into the ring. Oh, fine. Oh, right. Let's do that. Uh, <laughs> no! What? No! <laughs> went right through the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I got out of orbit. <laughs> Them Russians are going to be awful mad, boy. Awful mad. Be careful, there's a midget dog in there. He bit me. <laughs> Here, help me into the wing, will you, boy? No, I don't. Boys, we're not going to rehearse this fight scene. Oh? We're just going to shoot it the way it goes, so make it good. Okay, okay boys, roll them. Roll them? Roll them? Yeah, come on. Oh, buddy, come on. <laughs> 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 you stop shadow boxing. That fight hasn't begun yet. It hadn't. Well, you better keep an eye on that shadow because somebody's beating me to death. <laughs> Over here, please. <laughs> uh, Mr. Wentworth, yes. uh, no hitting be below the belt like this, sir. Uh, <laughs> no. uh, Mr. Wentworth, no rabbit punching like this. Yeah, you know, none of that stuff. You wouldn't do anything. No, that, would you? Of course. It's the first time I've ever been knocked out by a referee. Yeah. <laughs> well, all right. I want you guys to go to your corner and come out fight. Yeah, could I start from here? I don't think I can make it from over there. <laughs> get to your corner. Yeah. Oh, stupid. Right here, Mr. Wentworth. Somebody help me get my robe off. Would you probably take my robe off of me? Yeah, yeah. Boy, I thought I would punch you. You can't get it off that oh, way. Oh, wait a minute. Let me get it. I'll get it. <laughs> yeah. It ain't gonna work that way. No, I guess not. I got a better idea. What that? Oh! <laughs> I guess that won't work either. I think you better try this. All right. Let's move. There we are. Oh, there's the bell. All right, Mr. Wentworth. <laughs> we get it. <laughs> what are they remaking? The Great Wall? <laughs> Perspiration. What's wrong with that? It'll ruin my makeup. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, come on, Mr. Wentworth, knock him out. Wait a minute, now, you wouldn't hit a helpless man, would you? My dear boy, those are the ideal conditions. Oh. <laughs> You'll knock your kneecap off. <laughs> oh. I did it. You hit me. I did. Yeah. I did it! <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, come on. He's the kind of fight I want to do all the time. It's the first one I ever won. <laughs> I come here. Would I really? How about a kid? <laughs> this is Gary Moore speaking for... For me, Carol Burnett. Watch it. You gotta watch that girl. Watch us all next on most of these stations.